Hey, 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 how y'all doing today? How are y'all doing today? It's time for another one. Let me see if I could just, boom, there we go. <laughs> it's been a minute, hasn't it? Hasn't it since you've seen my wonderful face? Uh, I don't know about that. <laughs> it's been a while. It's been a while. Uh, listen, it's been kind of a week. Uh, a lot's going on, you know. I'm putting out content like crazy. I, I might, might, might drive me a little crazy, but I love it. It's the kind of crazy I'm all about. Okay, I'm gonna tell you something right now. We're getting close to the end of the year. A lot is happening. I'm trying to like plan everything out and not lose my mind. You know, I'm planning out the next year. Basically, that's who I am. I'm a, I'm a planner. <laughs> I'm a planner. Listen. Let me, let me move this real quick. I just want to readjust this. I don't like it. All right. Listen, I'm a planner, okay? I, that's, who I, that's who I am. I don't know what I just did. I must have knocked something over. We'll find out. Hopefully, I didn't delete the video. <laughs> like the video, the video uh, hard drive. I'm not even going to say that. That's, that's cursed. I'm not doing that. Look, look. I'm a planner by heart, okay? I have a vision, all right? And when I have a vision, I, I write it down what I want out of life, just like anything else in life. I want this, 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 and this. I put it down. I say, all right, Ian, how much time are you going to put into it? And I do it, okay? I just do it. I don't worry about it. I don't freak out about it. I still have perfectionism, but my perfectionism is now way more under control, okay? So today, I want to talk to you about the origin, the origin of this whole thing, this whole mentality, this whole ideology, praxology, whatever you want to call it, philosophy, okay? Because after I watched the Matrix movie and after a lot of people watched the Matrix movie, a lot of people were, uh, you know, kind of reminiscing over the last year, um, last maybe two years if you think about it, about the whole RP, you know, uh, community, atmosphere, mentality, mindset, whatever you want to call it, praxology, you know, that whole sphere, the manosphere, whatever, there's been a lot of criticisms of that, right? Now, you know, I, I, I stay out of it, okay? I stay out of the, the I don't want to have anything to do with the drama, okay? Y'all know me. I'm a very, uh, when it comes to drama, all right, it's got to be popcorn good, not sad, <laughs> okay? I don't want to have anything to do with it, all right? But what I'm trying to tell you is a lot of the, the ideologies of the whole pill concept or whatever it has been under some, you know, some criticisms. And I'll be honest with you, that's valid, right? That is a valid thing. But here's the thing, okay? What's the difference between this and all that other stuff? I'm going to tell you the difference between this and all that other stuff out there, okay? This was created as a parody. It was a parody, right? The, the idea of... Like a pill, you're taking this pill, that pill, this pill. All of a sudden, you got a you got a jar of pills. You're just popping all those pills. That's bad. Okay, what I did was I created a idea of a praxology that was already existing, right? That people were already doing, right? There's lots of people out there who were doing it, right? Who went their own way, who went and did their own thing, who who forged their own, you know, their own environment. You know, shout out to Greg B. Shout out to Artemis, shout out to Abe, you know, even shout out to Zebo. shout out to Sam, shout out to Chris. You got a billion people out here. There's billions of people, all right? You know, Aleph, all right? Shout out to Aleph. He's doing his own thing. People doing their own thing. They're not following a rubric. They're not following, you know, they're not like beholden to this rubric of how to go about life, right? You're talking about being your own person. Okay? You're talking about looking at the idea of what an independent person is, what a sovereign individual is, what a uh, person who is going their own you know, uh, journey, on their own journey, right? taking life by their own hands and doing it. And actually doing it, not just like talking about it, right? You know, we got, so, we got people out here who are moving. They moved, their, they moved their whole lives somewhere else to change their whole lives. They left their job, they rugged it, and they went to a whole other state. You know, shout out to Lawrence, all right? People leaving their home and they're going elsewhere where there is prosperity, where they can create a new 
world for themselves, a new community for themselves, a new life for themselves, you know? And that's the whole point of the shadow pill. It's not this idea of it's this pill versus that pill, this pill, that's for that pill. That's not what it is, okay? It's going your own way. And not like that other way we're talking about, what people talk about when they say go their own way. I'm talking about you're forging your own path, okay? Literally, you are looking at everything else that's happening around you and you are choosing for yourself what works for you, right? Taking pieces of everything and leaving what doesn't, you know? Even that environment, you know, and all these other little subgroups, there are people who take word for word and follow it like it's church, you know? They follow the doctrine of whatever the book, you know, whatever the content creator says. They follow it rule by rule, minute by minute, line by line. And in my opinion, right? Those content creators, not they're not living your life. You're living your life. It's you who's responsible for your life, right? And that's why I made this whole thing. This whole idea came from, you know, being, uh, you know, a person who was frustrated with the outcome. And I was looking at my outcome and saying, how come I, I don't have the outcome I want? I followed everything. I'm talking about me right now. I was following content creators who said, do this, this, and this, and this, and this, and just, just hold, Okay. Let's go back to, in fact, let's go back to sell. Let's talk about sell, all right, as a great example. You saw those sell episodes. You know why? Do you know why I did those episodes? The number one reason, okay, the number one reason, because it was because it was indicative of so many ev events that happened this year where you follow the doctrine, you follow the way, you did the thing, you did everything right, and it failed. OK, and it wasn't because, oh, you didn't do it right or you didn't do all you did was buy and hold. All you did was follow the directive, whatever that person said. Oh, do this and this and this and this and this and this and this. It was time to stop. All right. I'm just to, just to, <laughs> I'm using that meme now. It was time to stop. All right. For lack of a better term, it was real dumb to just follow the leader as opposed to becoming your own leader. Okay, and I paid for it dearly, big time. Okay, some might say bigly. That's how ridiculous it was. Okay, so for me, it was a good life lesson to learn. A lot of opportunity cost had occurred. I missed out. I'm gonna say this. I'm gonna say this, and I've I've only said it in private. I missed out on millions. Okay, millions, and that's I'm gonna live with that for the rest of my life. Okay, what I'm trying to tell you is. I'm not like blaming people and like oh, oh him and him and his, his fault and her, her fault. Although there is there is equal there is an equal amount of like uh, responsibility accountability there, right? Research proper research was done with the leader from the leaders versus also me not taking accountability for myself and and doing my own research. You know, actually D Y O R as they say, right? And being you know confident enough to believe in my own ability to do proper research, right? It was black pilling. I'm going to say that. Another another pill. <laughs> another pill. <laughs> it was black pilling. You know, it was depressing. So, this entire journey, okay, of life lessons, and there was multiple, I'm not even going to mention because we'd be here all day, compounded into this moment where I sat down and I said, "Okay. I need to stop." I need to go away for a little bit and figure things out. I need to look at what's going on with my own mindset because I had a good mindset. It's just it wasn't translating into this environment. It wasn't translate. I wasn't bringing it with me into other environments. That's when I realized I have an opportunity here to change that about myself. Let's do that. So I broke everything down myself. I looked at all the things about myself. All the flaws, all the cons, all the pros, all everything, all my qualities, right? And I said, okay, what is it about me in this environment that is my problem? And I broke it down and I realized I wasn't going my own way. I wasn't finding my own path. I was not taking my own path. I didn't even create my own path. I didn't even create my own path. I was just blindly following in the wind. Because I was unsure and I was not confident in this environment. Okay? Now, 
when I first started doing, uh, started doing, when I started actually, you know, practicing this philosophy, you know, this praxology, when I was actually practicing it, I went out and I took a leap. I said, let me go ahead and do this play. I'm going to go ahead and invest here. And I followed through with it. And it was very successful for me. It was very successful. It was a good sign. First moment, I said, wow, I actually am making it happen. I'm actually going my own way and this is working. This path is my path. I, this was my success. You know, I, 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 I take credit for my own success. I'm doing good here. I, I'm going to go ahead and share this with the group. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tell people what I'm up to and whatever. And so this was born. Okay. They even look at the color. The color ain't even the the color ain't even a color. There's no color there. It's 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 a it's a white pill, which is also symbolic because a white pill is the concept of you know hope. You know there's a there's a positivity behind it. There's something going on there. It's the absence of all these colors. Okay. The shadow pill is this concept of you making your own success, making your own future, taking the future in your own hands. Another reason, another reason why this shadow pill whole thing can't exist was because of this wax nonsense. I was, I was faced at a crossroads. I said, do I choose bodily autonomy or do I choose to be sheep? Do I choose to be a lemmings? Because there was times in my life where I did take the knee, you know, when it came to employment, when it came to whatever, you know, employment was like a big one for me because I came from a place I told you guys. I told you guys, this all culminates to, into this whole thing. It's all connected. It's all connected. I had a mindset of that nine to five slave mindset, you know, where you go to the job, you're grateful you have the job, blah, blah, blah. You're, 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 you thank the boss, all that stuff. It was unhealthy. It's very unhealthy, you know. So when you, when you and, and that's something that came from, you know, you grow up in, a, in, a, in an impoverished home. That's you're just gonna have that. That's just a very likely scenario. Cause what else is there? You know what I mean? What what else is there? You're gonna be pretty much about that uh uh you know graciousness. You're gonna be like, oh thank you, whatever. Just like you say thank you, God, you'd be like, Oh, thank you. Basically, thank you, God. And you're like, wait, time out, time out for one second. So is this job your God? What is this? Is this church to you? No, that's wrong. That's you, again, it all culminates to the same thing. It all connects. You having the lemmings mindset, you having this, you know, I'm gonna be honest, slave mindset, you know, this office plantation mindset, right? That and you, <laughs> it's gonna get you, it's gonna get you rugged. You're gonna get rugged, okay? And there's multiple venues and multiple different ways to get rugged in life. So I created this, this shadow pill out of the whole out of a need like a it's, a it's a it's an idea that you can visualize in your mind as an object right it's a psychological belief not even a belief it's a psychological trigger for yourself so you can be like all right so what do i need to do just like how people have uh you know they have the cross or they have a book to represent something that they believe in right it's just a it's just a physical you know uh, representation of the actual belief right of the actual praxology philosophy whatever you want to call it now this is far be it from religious but this is a practice right this is a let me go ahead and go do this thing okay i took this pill whatever you want to call it i've taken this journey it's just another word for i've taken this journey i've i've dedicated myself to committing to myself right investing in myself right to make the best choices for myself by being a self-sovereign individual, right? In the independent visual individual. This is freedom. This thing is about freedom. It's all about being free. That's the end of the day. That's what it's about. You know, if the RP is about being aware about social dynamics between men and women, you know, versus, you know, uh, the, 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 the BP, which is, you know, uh, uh, having the fantasy of, you know, the Disney lifestyle, right? Then the shadow pill is all about being free from you know all these types of enslavements office plantation over taxation heck even taxation if you can right uh you know being beholden to people who who 
who aren't grateful to you or being beholden to people who have, you know, no say, really, should have no say in your life. Uh, you know, uh, the, these Palpatines, the Kingpins, uh, plant people, you name it, you know, you name it. There's so many people who want to enslave you, okay, because it's profitable. You know, the people say the imprisoned system, the prison system is a multiple million dollar, billion dollar industry about enslavement. I say it doesn't just stop there. I say there are multiple versions of that. You just have to recognize it. And this idea is about recognizing these other encampments, right? Because what are you doing? You're wasting your time. Remember? All these environments are about wasting your time, your energy. You come home, you're tired. You don't have the energy to do anything. The whole concept of the shadow pill was going your own way, which another reason why the shadow market is shadow market is because you're going your own way into this place that you're not supposed to go to. It's this marketplace that you're not allowed to go to. You're not, you shouldn't be going to there. Shouldn't be, right? It's a place that they don't want you to go to. You know, they want you to be beholden and slave to the dollar. Mr. Bill, okay? They want you to hold those George Washingtons until it goes into nothing, until they're pennies, until they're Lincolns, okay? Until you're holding copper in your hands. <laughs> basically, digital copper in your bank account is worth nothing, basically, almost, you know? A McDonald's Big Mac going to become $10, basically, and you're going to be sitting there holding the bag like a bag holder when the rug pull happens. That's going to be you. That's the whole concept. That's what they want. That's the plan. They won't tell you that. Bankers won't tell you that. I shouldn't even said bankers. I haven't had a I don't even have a word for them yet. That's how evil they are. <laughs> That's coming up. <laughs> I didn't say that. <laughs> YouTube, I didn't say that. <laughs> Love you YouTube. Okay? Love you. Anyways, there's a lot more. I want to give you an example of somebody who Okay, uh, somebody, after I've talked about all that, I want to give you an example of somebody who is, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, people have followed into oblivion, okay? What not to do. I'm going to show you what not to do, okay? I'm going to show you what not to do. Let me see if I can actually make this work and not break this thing. I'm going to click on, let's see if it doxes me or not. Hopefully not. Oh, I did it. <gasps> I did it. Success. Okay, so I'm going to show you a guy who is exposing another guy okay so the guy exposing another guy this guy here zach he's exposing another guy the guy who he is exposing is named crypto john uh, god john we're gonna just say cgw or uh who is eh, i'm just gonna call him cgw okay or cg cgj cg we'll call him cg it's easier or john we'll just call him john <laughs> that's gonna cause so much confusion we'll just say cg easy Okay, so CG has a paid group, okay? It's called the WWG, all right? I'm not going to say the whole name. It's not, it doesn't help anybody. Let me go ahead and what did I just do? What did I just do? Okay, there we go. I just want to make sure I click on it right. All right, so this guy, he has a platform, uh, which is a Discord and his little group with a Discord, and he... Uh, they pay him, okay? They pay him, uh, I think it's $20 a month. I don't know what the exact amount is. I'm not 100% sure. I forgot to look. Uh, but they pay him, okay? And every time, every month on his Patreon, whatever, they pay him for advice on what to put them, where to put their money, basically, okay? They, 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 they rely on him 100,000%. What should I do? What should I buy, John? What should I buy? And he tells them, you know what to what to buy what to buy basically and what to flip what to do you know how much to leverage all that stuff that's what he does that's his job that's his thing okay now he seems like your typical influencer okay but when he tells you something when he shells a a a, a token to buy okay he flips it he flips it he dumps on the people he dumps on his fans his supporters. Okay, there's some proof here. You can click on that. I'll put the link in the description, so don't even worry about it. Like, if, if you want to see the link here for yourself, no problem. Uh, now, I'm not going to go too much into detail, but I want to scroll down to the bottom 
for what happens, okay? This guy dumps on them. And in this community, you still have people who, even though they have been dumped on and they have been completely wiped out, you have people still defending this guy. Talking about, oh, yeah, it's not that bad, blah, 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 blah. Now, I don't know if they're also inside with him, but I know one thing's for sure. They still sleeping, okay? There's people sleeping even though they're getting dumped on, okay? These are people who don't see the writing on the wall. Now, other people did, and they found this guy. <laughs> and that's when everything started to fall apart. Okay, so let me just find it. Let's see if I can find it. Uh, da, 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 da. Let me scroll down all the way to the bottom. <laughs> this is so ridiculous. That's why you guys have to be careful. And you have to, you should be looking at your own path to being successful. Yes, again, use what works for you. Pick and choose what things work, right? But that also means drop what doesn't work. Okay, let me see if I can find it. Hopefully I can find it. This guy says many new mil this this gets me all the time. So this guy says many new millionaires will be minted and created in the next three months. My mission and goal is to help as many of you as I can touch seven to eight figures. So this guy's like, I'm your friend, I'm helping you, all that stuff. You gotta be wary. Okay? You gotta be wary. Influencers telling you that they're your friend, all that stuff, that's just, you know, Got to be careful. Though I want to everybody I want to I want to help you get to a million dollars. I mean, I mean, maybe he could, maybe he wants to. We we don't know, but we do know the actions are not matching what he's saying. So, you can click on the like again, you can like I said, you can click on the at the addresses. You'll see everything in there. Uh this guy is he went in. Um This guy's promoting at, uh, his uh business with athletes, talking about he's with athletes. So, so he's using his people as exit liquidity, basically, and it's it's a repeat pattern. You can click on that and see for yourself. <laughs> he went into protection. Okay, that's my love it when that happens. So when these guys go running and they go hiding, that's when you know it's a wrap. But still, people sleeping. They're gonna defend him. Let me see. You got one guy who's mad. He says, "Y'all <laughs> gonna address the scamming?" <laughs> you go here. I think. Uh, this is sad. So this is the outcome that can happen to you if you don't follow your own path. This guy is talking about he almost uh, committed something. Um, let me go ahead and cl click on that. Probably shouldn't have showed that part. I apologize to anybody who's triggered by that. Uh, YouTube, okay. <laughs> oh, okay, so there you go. There's another person's uh, recurrence. Let me see if I can scroll down to... Uh, all the way to the person who's still sleeping. Uh, duh, 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 duh. Let me see. Uh, over here. So right here, this guy says, "Guys, leave a good comment for this group. You know, we're trying to keep things positive and keep things going and everything." And I'm just like, "Listen, <sighs> this scam continues. People will double down, triple down as much as they can." Anyways, it goes, it gets worse, it gets worse. I don't want to show everything because it gets worse, it gets worse. Uh, <laughs> let just let just let it be known, it it does get worse, okay? Um, and I would not recommend at all. Uh, <laughs> I would not recommend at all going too deep. Uh, I was deep in there for a while. It's not good. But anyways, my whole point is this is an example of what not to become. Just double, you know, doubling down and still sleeping and still like, you know, um, you know, uh, drinking the Kool Aid, as they say, right? For lack of a better term, um, I, and and it's unfortunate that people actually become that uh, that person um, that they do become that way because you know it's just like it's like a, a fear thing. Like you're just like I gotta keep committing to this all the way. This can't be true. It can't possibly be true. Well, actually, to be honest with you. I gotta, you know, if it smells like a duck, if it smells like a duck, if it looks like a duck, it quacks like a duck, it's probably a duck, to be honest with you, you know, maybe sniff it, I wouldn't recommend sniffing it, <laughs> anyways, that's it, okay, um, there's lots more I could go into, but I think that's a good kind of overall, like, good overview of this year, of the process that got to this point, um, you know, I'm more than happy to go into more detail if you want to know more detail. Um, 
to next year, I said tomorrow, uh, next year, we're going to be doing a lot more with this stuff. Um, again, I'm not the kind of person, I'm not the kind of content creator who repeats himself, you know, and goes into like the same over and over and over and over again kind of content. Um, there's going to be some things that touch, like these people want to, you know, some isms that continue, like some phrases like these people want to make you slaves, here's why. But I like to refer back to the episodes. You know, I'm a guy who goes and says, go to my playlist because I'm going to be creating a playlist for this stuff so you guys can just go back in there and find all the good stuff in there yourself as part of the whole shadow pill thing, which is, you know, do your own research, right? Go your own path, go your own way, whatever. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna workshop that extra phrase because I don't want to be associated with like this other type of community. Not that, not to say that you know, again, do what works for you. But not to say that that is necessarily like, you know, uh, uh you know, uh, they're bad people or whatever. They're not bad people. You know, that people who believe in the whole men going their way or whatever. I'm not gonna say, I'm not gonna de denigrate them, but I will say, I. I'm going to workshop that phrase so it's not confusing to people. So anyways, that's it for now. Tell me what you think. If you liked it, if you didn't like it, what you like about it, what you didn't like about it, you know, uh, share it if, you, if you're willing to do that. It'd be great. Thanks so much. And as always, I will see you next time. Have a fantastic holiday and a happy, happy new year. Bye-bye.